all right we'll be looking at this senyata now i've already watched a little bit of this and i almost threw up because your mouse sensitivity is absurdly high i have no idea how you're able to play with this with this high sensitivity and as we'll see from the video you are not able to hit much so that is probably the main reason <laughs> so while we're chilling in spawn we can look at your heroes lineup your your team's lineup so i would say that like before we even face the enemy before we walk out the door we should think about who to support because Senyata's heal orb doesn't really heal for that much it heals for 30 healing per second which is not very much if we compare it to say Anna, Moira or Kiriko or uh, Baptiste which is they are around ish 70 and if they uh, you know Anna throws her grenades first and then start healing uh, our Moira uses her heal orb they can push that up to around 120 140 right and yours yours will always be 30. so if someone has heal orb on them and they're in a duel they're not gonna it's not gonna it's not gonna help someone survive if they're being focused down the heal orb is more about allowing team members who doesn't have access to healing to heal to stay in a position longer so what i mean is like uh, cassidy for example he is going to have to play at medium distance and he's probably going to uh, he's quite a big character and slow so he's probably to be to be effective on cassidy he's probably going to be catching some light spam damage so if you give the healer up to him this will allow him to stay and fight for longer before instead of catching too much light spam and then having to leave the position to pick up a medkit or maybe to get healing from Kiriko, right? While Reaper, so you you pay attention, you give it to Cassidy first, I'd say, even he, even if he's at full health, just to be like, hey, I got you, do it, go do your Cassidy thing. And then throughout the match, if you can see Reaper switching, uh, if if you can see Reaper, actually then be in a position to do his reaper thing like being close combat and you know being ready to do what the reaper does then i would switch it over to reaper right it's up to you to decide which dps is going to get your hero or which dps is in a position to do their job right now and maybe this changes throughout the match and you'll have to switch it you could say what about the doom fist am i going to give it to the doom fist when he dives in well yes and no <laughs> because it's only 30 healing per second so uh, doomfist has 450 health right For, uh, so a uh, cassidy on 200 health is going to value 30 healing per second a lot more than doomfist on 450 and hopefully uh, kiriko will also do her job and uh, ma mainly heal the tank so that's what I would have that's what I would have thought uh, before the doors even open oh uh. God, to anyone watching this, I'm sorry. Like, look at your crosshair, it's all over the place, up and down, left and right. It's like you're having a fucking stroke. What did you, why did you reload there? Wasn't there like a lot of targets? We're fighting, you have 20 shots. Why are you walking backwards? Fight! Position? Why? There's a fight going on, you can't just back up like this. Fight! Okay, black, okay. Maybe, 
I'm gonna go back so you can see for yourself just how crazy your uh, sensitivity is. Okay, we're gonna watch this at super slow motion. So now we're just w we're just watching you cross here, okay? Look at how often your crosser is on nothing. Okay. Good. You go too far. When you're trying to left aim at something on the left, you go too far left. When you try to aim to something right, you go too far right. And then when you start shooting now, you're gonna come around the corner now and check this out. Every click you every time you shoot you can see the mouse go up and down. Aiming at the floor. Okay. Okay, why are you repositioning? that weird aim because you repositioned the orb like five times in one second? The fuck was that? Purple. Oh. You're trying. You're trying to position the purple orb and then you cancel cancel it with trying to shoot at the same time. Uh, your sensitivity is still batshit insanely high. How are you like able to operate like this? Okay, so you're actually doing what I said about giving heal orb to the people who are actively fighting. Like the Reaper going up there, you get like, good luck Reaper, got your back. Now this guy's fighting. Now oh, he's peeking. Good. I'm not getting seasick watching this. Now. The issue with a big issue, the big issue here is that Ryan is a DPS. Like he's he's in his uh seventy percent of his kit of his job is just to deal damage, right? So seventy percent and you're not hitting shots because your sense is so insanely high. So you're not able to do seventy percent of his kit. So you have to you have to fix this. Uh I'm guessing this is mouse and keyboard, so a set a uh, sensitivity I rec recommend by default is 800 DPI with 5% in game sensitivity. And then if your mouse pad is really slow, uh, low, uh, small I mean, then you could consider bumping that 5% up to 6% or 7%, but only if you have a really small mouse pad. And if you don't know what DPI is, it's the, sensi the, the sensitivity of your mouse, so not not sensitivity in the game, but just on your mouse in in uh, by default. So if you have like a gaming mouse, there's probably a button on it that when you press it, it changes the sensitivity of your mouse. And 800 is usually the lowest setting. But what you can do is you can download a software that will allow you to customize like the lights on your mouse and customize the sensitivity of your mouse, like I have Steel Series mouse, so I've downloaded a software called Steel Series GG, which allows me to manually set the DPI of my mouse. So find out what engine is connected to your mouse. Again, 800 DPI, 
5% in game sense, I recommend. Uh, I would like to say it's really nice to see that you're not the is a classic Zen mistake is to be too far back and to be like this spamming weapons platform that doesn't aim their shots that just spams down from really too far away. So at least you're up close to the fight. This might be actually a bit too close, but uh, the most important thing is that you at least have some someone on your team in front of you, so you're not you are not frontlining. Uh, speaking about frontlining. <laughs> Like, I, do you see this? Do you see, like, the last five seconds, I'm not, I'm, I'm barely able to see what's going on because your, your camera is, like, shaking so much. Look at this. Look at this, how the fuck are you able to play like this? Ah! Now you're about to do something very, very bad. You're about to prioritize the objective over the fight. Okay, look. There's about to, there's a, uh, about to be, a, be a fight up here. Your team is pushing up. And your Doomfist is for some reason on the payload. And you, for some reason, are going to follow him. And the two of you are going to push while your team fights on top. This is crazy. This is crazy. Look, you know what? How? What's the easiest way to push the payload if the enemy team is dead, <laughs> right? If the enemy team is dead, they can't block you from pushing the payload. So forget about the payload. Push, go up there, win the fight, then push the payload. So, think, like you reaper cleans house, but we can't, we can't just say, oh, but it was okay. So that's a, that's a good play. No, that was a terrible play. I seriously, I can't handle watching you because I'm getting like motion sick of your sensitivity. So I'm gonna stop here. But so, but 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 this is good, right? You're you're supporting the DPS who are being active, the one who is showing you that they are trying to play, they're trying to be in a position to do what they're supposed to do. Then you kind of reward them with your attention, with your orb, right? And then fix your sensitivity and uh, prioritize, ki prioritize killing. Uh, killing. I just noticed that, you had, that the other team has a lever, so this is not the best replay to send for someone who might want to watch more of this. Try not to send a replay where someone leaves because that doesn't give like you can't. That's not a normal fight, right? There's not a lever in every fight you have. Anyway, I'm signing off. Toodaloo.